today we're looking at just customizing your my gm all right so what i do is i'll usually pull up a no no trainer before i even start my nba 2k 18 game and yes as you can tell this is on pc um so i start up no no trainer then it start the game once the game pulls up pull up Lim no no trainer uh just pull that right back up and you're going to want to press f1 to activate the tool f1 should turn green and then i start clicking refresh roster list i start clicking that right away a couple times and then i click it a couple times more again i don't know if this is just what i do and then i will either load the roster i want or load the save file that i want so like right now i'm going to go ahead and load up a modded uh my gm save i have it's a high school one so i load up my gm once my gm is loaded all the way up i pull up the no no trainer i click refresh roster list again and on the right side of the tool you'll see all of these names come up okay so you have to do it the way i did it well you don't have to but it, it works best if you do it the way I did it. Like you click refresh roster list when the game is booting up and then click it again once you have the roster or save file that you want. All right. So what we're going to do, let's just go to a roster. So I'm using this team modern day. You can see my roster here. What I'm going to show you is um, I'm going to trade for a player in game. So let's do Corey Joseph. Let's try to trade away Corey Joseph. And find Kevin Durant. Okay, Kevin Durant. Let's try to trade Corey Joseph from our team to get Kevin Durant from Oak Hill. Do you want to do this? Let's click. Uh, we want we want to make this trade. All right, they're not letting Kevin Durant go. There's no way in hell anybody would ever trade Corey Joseph for Kevin Durant in real life. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the Nono Trainer. I'm just going to click on one of the names in the list, and then I'm going to find Corey Joseph by typing his name on my keyboard, C-O-R-Y, and then his name pops up at the bottom. So I double click Corey Joseph. His last name is up here at the top of the tool. And then I start typing in Kevin Durant, K-E-V. All right, there he is. Double click on him and then go to the left side of the tool click trade players see that arrow go across so you just need to click it once kevin durant is now on our team so uh the first year of my gm kind of makes you trade away players you can use this tool to go and get those exact same players that the computer is going to trade away you can use this tool to get them right back um, and as you see i have a modded roster i can go over some more modding things for my gm i just wanted to show you guys this all right, stay tuned. I got some more.